it's just nice to see people back on the lawn. Hot Springs National Park was officially open today after lawmakers finally cut a deal late last night. I don't think it is over and done with. It's just postponed for a bit. But it's hardly cause for celebration, as Congress is expected to discuss the budget again sometime in January. Don Harper, owner of Quapaw Baths, feels another shutdown isn't too far off. Relieved that uh, they did come to some understanding. Disappointed that we've got another round of this coming up. He says his business didn't suffer. The overall flow, the crowd flow is a little less. But he fears another shutdown could last longer and he may not be so lucky next time around. The longer it lasts, the more detrimental it will be not only to us but to most businesses. Susie DeArmond says round two of a government shutdown would be bad for business since the park is what draws tourists. I mean, it could really hurt us because this is Hot Springs National Park. When it was shut down, I had several people say, you know, the parks are closed and we wanted to go and enjoy the water. What the future holds is anyone's guess, but that means preparing for it is nearly impossible. Hard to plan when you don't know what's going to be next. But for now, tourists and residents like Leah Warner will do what they can, which is enjoy the national park while the government is operating. Hot Springs, it's the greatest place to be for a day or a weekend or a couple of weeks. Especially when it's open. Especially when it's open.